So this question looks like it's going to be a simplify question. Simplify questions are typically short, one to three lines long, and contain either an equation or an expression. This question doesn't have either an equation or an expression, but we do see equations in our answer choices, so I'm pretty sure we'll need to simplify those. So the question says, which quadratic equation has no real solutions? So no real solutions, whenever you're solving a quadratic equation, means that your solutions are imaginary. And the way that we can figure out whether a quadratic equation has imaginary solutions or not is through this formula, b squared minus 4ac. And if b squared minus 4ac is less than 0, that means that the quadratic equation that b squared minus 4ac came from has imaginary solutions. Okay, So that's what I'm going to use. I'm going to use this formula for my answer choices to find where, when I do this, do I end up with a value that is less than 0. So let's try choice A. So for choice A, there actually isn't a B because, again, this comes from A x squared plus B x plus C. That's where the A, B, and C come from. So there isn't an X term for choice A. There is a A term. So B is 0. So automatically that's going to be 0 squared, which is just 0, minus 4 times A, which is 3. And then also for choice A, C is equal to 0 as well, right? There isn't this last term. I'm sorry, C is actually equal to negative 3. So let's put that in, negative 3. And negative 4 times 3 is negative 12. Time negative 3 is positive 36. And positive 36 is greater than 0, so that's not imaginary. Choice A is gone. Choice B, let's do the same thing. A is equal to 3. B is equal to 3. So B squared is 9 minus 4. A is 3. C, there is no C term here, so that's going to be 0. So this whole thing becomes 0 here. This equals 9. 9 is greater than 0, so that's also not going to give us imaginary solutions. So choice B is gone. Choice C, A is 3. B is 3. C is 3. So we'd have B squared is 9 minus 4. A is 3. C is 3. And I end up with 9 minus 36 which is negative 27. Negative 27 is less than zero. That's exactly what I'm looking for in order for my solutions to be imaginary, which means choice C has to be the correct answer. We can double check for choice D as well, just to make sure. Here, A is three, B is negative six, and C is three. So B squared would be 36 minus four. A is three, C is three, and this ends up being 36 minus 36, which is equal to zero. Zero, of course, is not greater than zero. It's just equal to zero, or it's not less than zero, I should say. So therefore, choice C is the only answer choice that gives us a B squared minus 4AC that is less than zero, and therefore, it's the only answer choice that gives us imaginary solutions, aka no real solutions.